I'm Mike Helgren with an update on Baltimore's Metro subway system. And WJZ has learned that the big problems are with the elevated tracks starting at the northern end of the system, which is in the Owings Mills area. And they, the, the tracks have uh, damage, uh, and this covers about half the total distance of the metro system. So what they're telling us now is that it may be several weeks before that is repaired. Initially we'd heard Monday, now we're hearing uh, those portions of the metro starting at the northern end may not reopen for several weeks, but they're still investigating the problem. We talked to the MTA administrator who said that safety is their number one priority. They didn't want to take any risks. However, we also talked to some union officials and they tell us that there were uh, known problems with the tracks for years and that they have been trying to get attention to this problem. They say, you know, we've heard about the DC Metro's problems, but we have uh, much worse problems right in our own backyard. They say the system is unsafe. And so they're glad that this is getting attention now, but they say it should have been done much sooner. That's the latest on the Metro subway problems. I'll have more tonight at 4, 5, and 6.